Hi, I'm Nikki Hansel from Paper Free Corporation. This is part two of a seven part series on Captiva Capture 7.5. Our topic is import. Now, import means just bringing information into an automated capture system. And every capture system has to start with importing information. There are many sources of import. Let's talk about them. Paper that perhaps your company generates internally or that you receive from customers, emails and spreadsheets, faxes, electronic data feeds, and mobile devices. Captiva Capture 7.5 is all you need to convert all of these different import sources into readily available, automated, and easily accessible information. Let me show you how it's done. The Captiva Scan Plus module allows you to import existing electronic files into a Captiva process. First you click on Create New Batch, then select the project the batch belongs, and click Create. Next you will select to Import Files. You'll highlight the files for import, and click Open. Those files will open in the form of thumbnail images, and each page will appear in the center of the screen. The thumbnail inside the red box will appear in the full view image on the right-hand side of the screen. You can easily adjust the zoom level. Click on another thumbnail to change the full view image focus. Click Finish Batch to close the batch. The finished batch will be sent to cleanup. You can also use Captiva Scan Plus module to scan paper and create batches of electronic images. Click the Scan Pages button and that activates the scanner. Captiva will assign a batch number, count the number of pages as they're scanned, as well as track the scanning time. When all the pages are scanned, the scanner will automatically stop and you have the choice to either scan more pages or finish. Again, those thumbnail images and the full view focus will display on screen as we saw in the import process. Email attachments and information from the body of an email can also be imported into a Captiva process. In this example, we're importing an employment application in PDF format along with information about the sender and the subject of the email. Once that email is imported, specific data is parsed out and can be presented to an operator for review. You can see the sender information as well as subject and information from the document that was uh, attached to the email is included. Standard import provides another form of automatically importing data with no manual intervention. You see here an empty folder. This is being monitored by Captiva throughout the day. As files appear, Captiva will import those files into the Captiva process. Importing data using the Captiva mobile app is an easy way to capture content from any location. Mobile users will download an app that can be customized and branded for customer use. In this example, the mobile app is being used to submit expense reimbursement information. The mobile user enters a few required fields then has the option to include photos of receipts or other supporting documents. And finally, submits all the information for import into a Captiva process. Once the information has been imported, we're ready for the next step, which is cleanup. So please join me for a deeper dive to see how Captiva Capture 7.5 can help meet all of your automation needs. And for more information, please come to 
paperfreecorp.com. See you soon.